Well, I just arrived at the Sierra Vista Mall, the location of the 33rd Southwest Wings Birding and Nature Festival. Come on, let's go. Southwest Wings Birding and Nature Festival is Arizona's oldest birding festival. This is the premier nature festival in Arizona, consistently voted one of the top five birding and nature festivals in the country. The summer festival is held in August and is the biggest event with free programs, wildlife exhibits, vendors, and guided tours, along with a keynote buffet. Southwest Wings is an educational celebration of the diversity of birds, mammals, reptiles, and insects in their environment, the Sky Islands of Southern Arizona. Small group trips are limited to a maximum of 10 people plus a guide. The roster of guides includes many professional bird guides from the area who know the birds and where to find them. The group van field trips left from the Sierra Vista Mall, filled with excited birders who are on their way to a great adventure. I'm Jill Hayes and I'm with Holbrook Travel. It's our first time here at the Southwest Wings Festival and I went on a field trip this morning with Christy Gallo and it was called the Hummingbird Hunt but we also saw other birds as well. We went to San Pedro house and um, that was really nice. I had never been there and then we went to Ramsey, Ramsey Canyon which was great. Uh, we saw, uh, first we heard the elegant Drogon and we found that bird and that was really cool. There's another bird I've been trying to see for a long time called the Sulphur Belly Flycatcher and we saw several of those. They sound like a dog's squeaky toy so that was really fun. And we also saw violet crowned hummingbirds, two of them in a nest. Um, yeah, little babies in a nest. It was so cool. Um, then we also went to Ash Canyon and I saw a Lucifer hummingbird for the first time. So, uh, you know, this place is all that, that people say and more. I just love this area of Arizona. It's so nice to be back after probably 10 years. It's my first time back. So I'm having a wonderful time so far. For those not going on the field trips, there were three and a half days packed full of free lectures and presentations that were open to the public. Topics included hummingbirds, bird photography, bird anatomy, as well as related topics of habitat and bird migration. There were free bird walks that were also open to the public. Experienced guides took us to local trails right in the heart of Sierra Vista. As we made our way through the bird walk, we learned about common species that live here, the sounds that they make, and their behaviors. We had a very productive bird walk, noting over 30 species. Here's a few of the photos that I captured during that walk. After our bird walk, it was nice to be able to return to the air-conditioned mall where we could visit with vendors and exhibitors. So one of the big things we do here at the festival and coming as a forest service is talking about the multi-use within the agency. Um, something that people don't realize is a lot of the times when you're outside, you're on forest service land. And so whether you're out there biking or hiking or bird watching, you're probably on forest service if you're not on private or on BLM land. So here especially where a lot of birders tend to go and a lot of the big places where you're going to see those lifer birds are on forest service property. So we're here to share that. Yeah, we're here to just answer questions and help people find great places to see birds. The flagship activity of each festival is the catered dinner. We're privileged to welcome distinguished ornithologist, artist and author Julie Zickerfus is our keynote speaker, joining us all the way from Ohio. And Julie will be telling us about how she became a celebrated natural history writer and illustrator. <laughs> Julie, welcome. If you didn't make the 2024 Southwest Wings Birding and Nature Festival, no problem. Check out the link in the show notes below. For more information, and maybe we'll see you next year. Well, that's it for this week. Thanks for watching. Give the video a thumbs up and hit that old bell icon so you won't miss any future videos right here on Birds and More. Until next time, bye for now.